today's video, we're going to look at the Mass Delete Records option in the Salesforce Setup menu. With this feature, you can mass delete accounts, leads, activities, contacts, cases, solutions, products, and reports, and up to 250 items can be deleted at one time. This tool is ideal if you're looking to clean up your data, remove some excess public reports that are no longer in use, or even undo an import that was unsuccessful. Especially since we're dealing with deleting data, be sure to check the Salesforce documentation before using this tool for any considerations you may need to know before using this feature in your org. For example, you should know that when records are deleted using this tool, any associated records that display on that records related list will also be deleted. And as always, be sure to back up your data before using this tool. To use mass delete records in Salesforce, follow these steps. First, navigate to the setup menu. In the quick find box, type mass delete records and select it. A list will appear with what records are available to delete. In this example, we'll select leads. In the first step, Salesforce will tell you exactly what data will be deleted by this process and where it will go. In this case, we know that any activities associated with the leads we're deleting will also be deleted. And once it's deleted, it will be in the recycle bin. In the second step, Salesforce will remind you of best practices for archiving data and highly recommends these steps before continuing. Now, enter the criteria for which you want leads to be deleted. In this example, we're going to remove our web leads with the status of working contacted. Select the search button to double check your work. At this point, Salesforce will tell you if you've made an error in your criteria and it will show you which records you're about to delete. Finally, Salesforce provides an option to permanently delete the selected records, meaning you won't be able to recover them from the recycle bin. Select the checkboxes next to the leads that you'd like to delete. And when you're all set, select delete. And there you have it. 